So, you want to become Mike Wazowski, but you have two eyes. That's unfortunate. I recommend taking up a life of becoming a pirate. They seem to only have one eye. Hey guys, I'm about to touch my comment. Kyle, take, take back. We're back once again, taking a look at how I made this uh, cool little crate, um, which is super, super easy and super basic. Um, I'm essentially just taking a bunch of cubes and then duplicating them using Shift D. And then uh, I made one of them, one of the ends bigger, one of the ed ends bigger by hitting tab and then going to edit mode and then making like the top of the cube bigger and then stretching it. Um, so it's like long. And then I went ahead and just um, added these little planks on the side um, and then rotated them so they fit all, all different sides. I really, really like this um, this piece that we made today, this, this this little crate model. It's really cute. It's really like compact and I think it looks really good. It could easily go into a game. Or, um, or something like that, obviously. Um, it has a more, you know, stylized look to it than a realistic style, obviously. So this would go some, like, Crash Bandicoot-type vibes, Spyro kind of vibes, you know, something like that. But, um, but yeah, so I really, really, really like this. And I wanted it to be... Um, and I, went ahead, I actually beveled the edges uh, there as well. So I added a nice little, uh, nice little bevel modifier, which is really nice. But I wanted it to... Um, I kind of wanted it to pop a little bit more than what it was, what it was doing, and all of the brown just was not it, even though there are different shades of brown that I'm using in this, but I really, 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 really wanted it to kind of pop more, so I decided to add some, um, here's the beveling right here, um, I, I really wanted to add something different, and I think what really set it off is kind of these bolts that I'm going to do, these screw, the screws that I'm going to do in a second here. There's the different shades as well. Um, I just really like the the different tones of the brown that we did here. I, I'm I'm glad I decided to not keep it all the same color brown because that was a little rough to look at. But we had these nice little balls, which I literally just used um, a UV sphere for, and then just kind of shrunk it down. You know what I mean? And then um, used to be like nuts and bolts, that which I think looks really 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 cool. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed this build a lot. I I, I want to do more modeling on the channel so if you enjoyed it let me know down below as always i'll see you guys in the next one but until then bye bye